Hi, this is Eric with Hardy North America, and today I'll be showing you how to replace the micro switches in your pressure regulator. You'll need to replace the micro switches if you notice that the motor runs in one direction but won't reverse the other direction when it hits the limit switches, or if you notice a boom section staying on longer than the rest of them when you shut them off, or vice versa. Just as a reminder, anytime you are working with any sprayer components that have had chemical ran through it, you want to make sure you wear proper PPE. We recommend a face shield, protective gloves, and a full length jumpsuit. For the purpose of this video, we'll be using new components, so I won't be wearing any of this today. The tools needed to perform this task are going to be safety glasses, solder, a soldering iron, your hardy repair kit, and it also helps to have some kind of fixture or a way to hold your parts while you're soldering. In the Hardy repair kit, you'll find your upper and lower micro switches, as well as a plunger that contacts the switches. First, you'll want to remove the motor housing from the pressure regulator assembly. If you have questions with that process, refer to our part one video. The kits come with wires pre-installed onto the micro switches. We'll want to remove those before we install it into the motor housing. You'll want to pay attention to the orientation of the switches. There is an upper switch and a lower switch in the housing. We'll remove the first switch and desolder the wires. Once the wires have been removed, You'll want to discard the old switch and replace it with the new one and then solder your wires on. Once you're done soldering, you'll want to place the switch back into the housing. You'll want to make sure you have the orientation correct with the upper and lower switch. Both micro switches will need to be replaced. The process is the same for both the upper and the lower micro switches. That wraps up our how-to video on replacing the micro switches in your pressure regulator. If you have any more questions, please contact your Hardy dealer. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and see any future Hardy Academy videos. Thanks for watching.